Hey guys and girls, what's going on? Waterlemon77 here, and I feel like doing a random run today. Well, don't know what happened there, but I got Kane. Always happy to see. Oh, should have thought about this room. Should have thought about it. And actually get them all clumped up, anyways. That's not a very good start to the run. Miss playing the room. What? Hey, I managed to get out of there. Somewhat fine. Ooh, no thanks on the spiders. It's gonna be, it's gonna be a hard pass. Gonna have to pass on those spiders. Not gonna stick around and play with them. I think I got only one guy there. That makes me pretty sad. But there's a champion, and that is definitely good news. Could get me an extra key, and he actually does. Awesome. Book of Shadows is something. So we'll take that. And I'm probably going to use it against the boss. Champion Widow of the Black Variety. Black Widow. Okay, oh, easy there. Yeah, keep doing that coffee cough thing. Not actual coffee, just... That's a fun way to say it, I guess. Okay, spiders are creeping in. Had to use Book of Shadows there. Let's get rid of the Widow. Get rid of the Widow, actually find some free space. That spider's too good. Not the Widow, this double spider. It was too good, it was matching me move for move. Yeah, that's a real strong spider. I was there. Take my HP upgrade and let's get out of here. Yeah, I don't mind Curse of Darkness. Ooh. That's a lot of keys that are required here. I want to go to the library, but I don't want to go to the shop. That's the problem. I'm going to play out the rest of the floor. Oh. And see what it looks like. And I'll take my chances from there. So... Let's do that. Don't think I'm in any urgent need to check out the library. It would be nice, just doesn't need to happen right away. Okay. Got them all. Got both of them chasing me. Now they're both gone. I think I'll fight the boss really round out the floor before I do anything else. Duke of Fly shouldn't be too much of a problem. Especially if he doesn't spawn- oh, okay. Didn't spawn too many things, but when he did spawn that one fly, that was vicious. Oh. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. He's coming right at me. Who does he think he is? Who does this guy think he is? I think it's time to probably actually should have used that for the curse room. But that's my fault, I guess. No one to blame but myself. And some black flies. Don't know why I gotta deal with the angel right away. But hey, dead dove is good. That's the same as Spirit of the Night. Only free. Oh, terrible range. I don't really want a shot speed. I may actually just leave it there, believe it or not. Um, yeah, I'll check this out. And scapular in here, what's... What's going on? Um, sure. I guess I'll take it, but... Yeah, I don't really know what's going on. I got one key and three options. I could go door number one or door number two, hoping it's the library. Or I could open up the golden chest and try and multiply my keys, hope that there's two in there. That's also pretty risky. Um, first thing I think I'll do is look for the secret room, which I think is going to be right here. 
Yep. And, okay, I'd feel less bad if I open up the shop first now. Mainly because I wouldn't feel as bad buying a key anymore. So that is why I feel like option three is out of the question and, um, out of feeling, right, almost from the beginning, this is going to be the library. It's not, of course it's not. Um, do I buy anything? Um, it's the tarot card or nothing. I think I will save my money. Short term it may not be good, but I think long term that's going to be the right move. And it's always good to think long term. With Dead Dove I'm pretty well set up for the next floor at least. So I think I can do fairly well here. Actually, never mind. I'm not going to do fairly well. I'm going to get hit right away. And then cry. Most likely. But not while recording. I'm going to cry after. Because I will remember that room. As the room I got hit in. Hit in or hit on. Oh. I guess those can mean two different things completely. But yeah. I got hit. I did get hit in that room when I said I wasn't going to. And that is definitely going to make me cry. This human popcorn room. Not really a problem. Do a book of shadows again. That one, this guy here, he scares me. Quite a bit actually. There's a champion. So I want to see what he's got. Oh, easy now. With this homing shot guy, I feel like I have to stay close to the walls, but they're very good at punching up in the middle. And my range is not superb, to say the least. Okay, he's gone. Let's watch out for that eternal fly. And... Oh. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. Maybe the Book of Shadows has something to do with the deal with the angel slash deal with the devil mix up here. Because you never find scapular in the curse room. Never. Not even on like a random chance type thing. So I think I'm going to try and do this boss as perfectly as possible. And I guess, oh, easy there, Mr. Pestilence. One way to do that against Pestilence is use whatever you got against the first stage. And what I had was the Book of Shadows. And while I tried to use it, it wasn't very effective. And I still have a long way to go. So, this is going to be a painful fight here. And by painful, I do mean painfully slow. Hopefully, I can get out of here without being hit. That is always the goal. But now it's especially the goal, because I've got to deal with angel rooms on the line, not just your regular old deal with the devil. Oh, that was a risk moving like that, but he's in his second stage now. If I can just clear the worms, that'd make everything better. Okay, one worm gone. Two worm gone. Three worm gone. And see if I can get four worm. Now he's got flies. Flies are not nearly as bad as worms. So I can live with that. Okay, unless you keep spawning them like that. Then it's going to be a slight bit of trouble. Okay, come on now. At least let me hit you. Or kill your own flies. That all works. Kill your own fly. Kill your own flies. There we go, now you're getting the hang of it. Turns out he's had to save enough times. Okay, that was close again. Yeah, if I'm looking for one thing, it's definitely damage. I don't know what in the... 
deal with the angel can give me damage. Like maybe sacred hearts. Um, anything else? Uh, not really. Anything else that I can think of would actually maybe you can get Blood of the Martyr there. That's a definitely a damage upgrade. So that would give you more damage. I guess you can get Halo. That's all stats upgrade. And that's more damage. Those wouldn't be bad things to find also. Yeah, those are just the only things that really popped into my head for more damage when it comes to deal with the angel. But that doesn't really matter now, does it? Because I did not get one. Hmm. I'll tell you what I did wrong. I got hit on that first room. That's exactly what I did wrong. Okay, do some of that. Doing some nice, making some runs in a line. These guys are pretty dumb, they can't hit me like that. And some bombs will not be very effective because I won't be using them in the mob trap room. Only two more cents before I want to check out the shop, but I'm all. Well, there's the money. Distant admiration, there we go. I'm also a few keys away. I think I'll look for the secret room though. Hopefully it's right here. Aha! Uh -huh. Unicorn horn, um... Less invincibility. But... I get an attack while doing it. It's tempting. But I think I gotta stick with Book of Shadows here. And the only reason for doing that is because of the chance that it has something to do with this deal with the angel thing. I want to kind of keep that going. And that may help keep it going. And I just wanted a key, so there's that also. Curse Room is not really something I want to check out, but I'm going to. Yeah, and... I had a feeling I was going to regret that. I'm just going to forget about it now and move on. Move on with my life. Okay, distant admiration. Didn't want to do anything there? No? Yeah, take him out. Take him out. Nice. Nice. I have a book of shadows charge here. May have to use it. This could be a very threatening room. Actually, too threatening for me. At my current state. No thanks, I'll take a pass on the shop. Because there could be another secret room right next to it. And there actually is. So. That's how I'm going to get there. And it's just greed anyways. So I spent two bombs to get to greed. What will greed get me? Maybe I'd be okay with the steam sale. But I guess I'm just I'm gonna look for money now. Uh huh. Uh huh. You got a lot of guys here. I hope you. Well, hope you I'm not overly powerful, Mr. Greed. So it's not very nice that you showed up. And if you could stop spawning more things, even though they are just hoppers, I get that. They are just hoppers. But please, please stop. Please, please, I can't, I can't handle the hoppers. Can't even handle the hoppers. Mr. Greed. Mr. Greed. Stop it. Stop it. Stop. Stop, Mr. Greed. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, Greed is down, and for my efforts, I get a troll bomb. And three more cents. Two more cents. Ooh. At least I got back to full health, but I lost some red health on the floor, so that sucks. Pills are good though. I'm Kane, so pills must be good. Okay. Not terrible. It's better than just a crappy room like this. Get a speed and a range upgrade. So 
so that's always nice. What do I do here? Do I go back and try and play that fortune teller machine at all? That's a great question. Not sure I know the answer to that. Yeah, Distant Admiration is doing some big damage. Not enough damage though. Okay, that, that felt necessary to me. Maybe it wasn't, but I went for it anyways. Don't need to spend money on this floor. So what you got for me? You're the new shop. Portable slot machine, huh? Ooh, that's gonna be very nice. Haven't seen Polyphemus in an item room for a long time. And now it makes it near impossible to shoot the fire. I'm not sure I have enough money to do the thing that I want with the portable slot machine. But the fact that there's an arcade and a boss trap room is lovely. Music to my ears. Combination that makes the world go around. Okay, keep going. Goodbye, Mr. Spider. Oh, I was close. And... Yeah, before I check out the boss trap room, I'm going to play the boss and I'm going to use the Book of Shadows. I'll take that. I'll take your HP and maybe even get more HP. So, here goes nothing. It's okay if you blow up into a blood bag. I would be okay with that. Not overjoyed, but just okay with it. So now, time to execute the plan of Boss Trap Room. HP upgrade. There we go. Mr. Monstro, how's it going? Don't think, as far as I can remember, didn't fight you. We fought, fought the Widow, I think. Oh, why am I so bad at remembering things right now? Oh well, it's not important to remember, just important to beat the Larry, the crap, let's beat the crap out of Larry Jr. Not the Living Daylights, we're beating the crap out of him today. It's funny because Larry Jr. does poop. I guess maybe not in this form, but he can poop. Get that key and try and work the system here. It's gonna be real hard with the key of meat and distant admiration. Never really thought of that. Wanna get just a regular old black fly? Oh, 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 first try. First try. Oh, I don't believe it. Oh, that's too good to be true. Oh my. Well, wait till you see what we got here. Oh, we're fighting the husk again. We're fighting the husk. Watch out. Husk is tough. He could do some real big damage. I mean real big damage. Oh, watch out. Aha. Aha. Joke's on you, game. Oh. Guess the joke's on me. Don't really want that. Well, I got some more red health. That's nice. Right? I'll just take that too. Do you think you'd do it twice in a row? You'd be my best friend. So please. Twice in a row. I won something. I guess Kane is fairly lucky. At least he's supposed to be. Okay, you know what, take it just because, and that's all I really wanted. That is all I really wanted. Okay, sweet. And it was a deal with the angel too. I'm gonna still try 
this tactic here. Not gonna go below 15 cents. And you know what? It worked once, so I think it's can work again, at least. So, I'm gonna stick with the portable slot machine. And any extra money I get will be put towards getting black flies. Okay, I really want to shoot the red fire. It's just too hazardous to me. And that's why it's hazardous. Okay, just just go away. Thank you. And fire that way, this way. Okay. Swing around. Dosey -si do. Okay. Back to full health. That's always good. He blew the cover. He blew my cover. Well, maybe not completely. And... Oh, run. I had to. I had to run. I had no other choice. Okay. We're gone. Forget me now is also another option if the black fly doesn't work out. Okay, so this game has given me a lot of interesting options here. And, hey, it's always nice to have different options than normal. This is, yeah, definitely not the most standard run. Lots of twists and turns here. And that's a good thing. Keeps the game fresh. Okay, here we go, do some of that. Okay. Not greed. Get that treasure map. Where's that secret room? Maybe I can buy that soul heart with money from the secret room. At least that's the plan. I'll take your one up anyways. Now is the boss going to be this way? We have yet to find out. One shot, two shot, red shot, blue shot. Okay, both of them are one head away. Rando pill is tears upgrade. Awesome. I actually really needed one of those. Oh, they can fly over rocks. These ones, but fish look not. I am starting to learn. Aha. That's not good for the game. That's great for me, though. The fact that I can learn things. Okay. I'm gonna go fight the boss. It's the Fallen. It'll be interesting to see if the Fallen will drop a deal with the Angel item. Kind of like the Curse Room did. I don't think that will be the case, but it wouldn't hurt. That's for sure. Do something like this. I'm really focusing a lot on that guy. Oh, okay. Couldn't really see a way out of that one. Okay, good. He's gone. Just one left. I got the speed to run away from you. Get those diagonal tears working. Okay, deal with the devil item, and an actual deal with the devil. For some pretty terrible items. Yeah. No thanks. I think I'm just gonna walk away from that kind of a deal. And I'll see if I can gather more money before trying to get that black fly once again. I think that's the miter starting to work. That's definitely the miter starting to work. Okay. Try and clear some space for me. But that's kind of hard when they move around as much as they do. Get that one, then that one. Nice. More money's good. 
And you know what? I'll check out the curse room. Well, thanks for that. That's nice that you want to make sure I get there into the deal with the devil room, but I don't really need it. And Guppy's head. Oh. Do I stick with Guppy's head or do I just forget me now this place? I think the answer should be obvious. Oh, well, that's a waste of Guppy's head, but hey. Oh. Well, portable slot machine is in the... What should we call it? The curse room. And I don't really feel like losing another half soul heart, so... Goodbye everything. And hello everything. That's a library. Ugh. I could be doing some big damage. Big damage with the Book of Belial. Luckily I have the keys to be able to go into the library too. Check out this... Secret room. See if I can't get enough money. And with just one more cent to go I'm feeling pretty confident. Okay, well... Now I'm 100% sure I can get the money. To buy the good item if there is one. Which there is. Now once again I'm going to be looking to buy that soul heart. That's going to be... A mystery item to see if I can get that. Even though pills would be good, I don't really feel like buying that pill. Okay. Forgot about turrets. They're right there in the middle of the room, but... Still forgot about them. I don't know how that works, but... Ask my brain. Okay, do that. And run away like that. And like this. Aha! Victory! Ooh, very nice soul heart. I'd like to start stocking up on those. And as quickly as possible. That guy. Do something like this. Something around that. I think I'm gonna be heading towards the boss room, to be honest. That's just my feeling. And no, don't wanna hit anybody. There you go. Okay, make the rounds. Oh, okay. Fighting these guys normal now. Can't do this. Cheap distant admiration fly crap. Doesn't work. I'm not good enough for that. Maybe I'm not bad enough for it. Ooh. Now oh, there's a twist. Probably the first option though. Oh my. There is no worse time for that to happen. Okay. Still managed to get away with only being hit once. Well that was well worth it. And this is still only depths part one. You wanna go laser beam mode? Yeah. That's okay with me. We can go laser beam mode. Okay, just keep doing something like that. Try to get that distant admiration in there. Oh! That could cost me. Never mind. I can buy a soul hurt with this money. And in here is... I'll tell you exactly what's in here. Very intriguing proposition in Guppy's paw. Common cold, not super interested in, su not super interested in, since I'm not firing too many tears. But Guppy's paw, on the other hand, yeah, you know what? I think I'll go all out there, and that's that's gonna be a good thing, I'm sure. I'm just a guppy's tail away from firing in some extra flies, which would do big damage. Especially if I have the Book of Belial still with me. And that'd be pretty crazy. Be able to whittle down any boss's health 
relatively quickly. Although, as it stands, can't even beat Fistula. Not even a fully formed Fistula, just a bunch of parts. Can't even beat that without being hit. And I knew that you were hit before. Something along those lines there, and... Oh, come on. Thanks for the key. You can go away. You can go away. And now I can hide over rocks if I really want. But I'm not about that. So I'm just going to kind of hide over the rocks. Just a little bit. Not completely. They're there for safety measures. Quad shot Polyphemus. Sign me up. I like my tears could have gotten much worse anyway, so. Yeah, that's that was worth it. The tears actually almost seem to be better. That's pretty scary. And this one. Okay, finally. Feeling pretty confident to check out the curse room. Definitely something that I should look into doing every time. Aha, got his paw. Aha. Can't use it. I guess I will buy the soul heart. No. No, not gonna buy the soul heart. I know there is a very good chance greed will be in the next shop, but I feel like I gotta take the risk and save my money. Okay. Finally, we meet Necropolis Part 2. This is Rando Pill. Falls of Steel, and another range upgrade. Hey. Not bad. Okay. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty strong right about now. I can, I can hold off on damage for a bit. Health would be nice. So, Miter, if you want to work your Miter magic, that'd be great. Don't really know how else I'm going to get more soul hearts, but Miter is definitely a good place to start. If you're only going to get a single item to get you more soul hearts, I think I would pick Miter. Not the Relic, not the Nail, not the Book of Revelations. I'd pick Miter. It's just it's real solid at getting you those soul hearts. Take a free secret room. Hey, that's awesome news. Seeing greed here instead of the shop. I'll take that. Mm. I was going to say any day of the week, but most days of the week. About six days of the week. There may be one day where I'm feeling a little funky and want to mix things up. But today is not that day. Goodbye to you. And all those guys. Okay. I actually have a lot of money. Don't fight the boss. Don't pass go. Don't collect $200. That's how this floor works. Although there seems to be many different branching paths to this floor. And kind of a neat little... Way to lay out a floor, but not my favorite either. But hey, it works, so I guess I just gotta roll with it. And it's going quite well, so I can't complain. For Necropolis Part 2, could have been going much worse. Ooh, not worth it. It's basically a key for a penny. Terrible trade. Well, I got my key back, but for the cost of a few pennies. So I pretty much lost like two pennies. So that's a real shame. World is going to be better than bad gas. That's a guarantee. Come on, pay out soon. Still have the shop to go to. 
I still have the shop to go to. Buddy, you're killing me here. You're killing me. Okay, compass. Now I just need one more cent somewhere on this floor. And preferably not the boss room. That's not a penny. Okay. Those guys are gone. This guy can go away. Penny, come on, Penny, come on, Penny. Oh no. Hey, Demon Baby's pretty good. Welcome to the crew. I just need one more penny and I got two rooms to do it. Well, I guess I could also look in the shop hoping that there is a penny of fire somewhere. I guess I also could go to the mob trap room if I'm that desperate. Which it's looking like I might be. Ooh, that was close. Let's run to this side. Okay, let's try penny in the shop tactic. Actually, I don't need 15 cents because I don't want the steam sale. Take the fool. Definitely worth the purchase there. It's looking for a card like that, actually. So it's nice that it happened to show itself. Of course, at the cost of five cents, but if I get deal with the devil or maybe even deal with the angel again, I'm still not 100% sure on which one's which now. I think with Book of Belial, it's most likely deal with the devil. But, that's okay too. Actually, maybe it's not okay. Because I don't really have any health to give. Um, I think the safe move here is to not take meat until I at least see if I do have a deal with the devil. Do I want the world card? Eh, you know what? Eh, forget about it. That's right, I'm that lazy. Don't want to backtrack. Okay, no deal with the devil, that makes it easy. No meat. Maybe I... No, I did buy treasure map somewhere along the way. Okay. So, rope card was useless. So it's a good thing I didn't backtrack. Let's go like that. Like this. There's my penny. And see if I can actually get a few more pennies. Nope. I have to spend money there. Chub. Hey. Hey, buddy. You got, you got some nubs there. Oh, man. Chub probably should have hit me. But hey, I'm not complaining. And, okay, Demon Baby, take it easy. I learned to take it easy, Demon Baby. Champion Death. Ooh, this is going to be somewhat tricky. I just got to use my damage. Try and get him down as quickly as possible. Main reason this guy is so tricky is just because of the crap that he spawns. Like, the bomb worms, worms are pretty evil. And then if he spawns, yeah, those things. They're pretty evil too. Okay. At least I'm gonna get a soul heart out of this. Since I did lose one. And I'm gonna be kind of neutral in terms of health. Second level Q of meat. Welcome to the party. And oh man, I'm surprised that I can actually take Guppy's tail. I'm Guppy. The Gupster. Ta-da! I knew I could fly already, but that still just adds a lot of power to the run. I think I'm gonna go and check out the boss trap room. Why? Well, because I can. And that's, I feel, is enough reason to do so. Okay, Mr. Gupster. 
doing real good with the flies. So just keep it up. Don't even want to go through the arcade. I don't care if there's a fortune teller in there. I don't think I'll need one. Yeah. Yeah. That's a range upgrade. I've got many range upgrades. Thanks to pills. Ooh, another range upgrade. Might as well use it. It's a fairly long room. And it can't hurt. Although the, the room itself could hurt, but using Book of Wild can't really hurt. And I don't need your money. Okay. Feeling real strong here. Gonna make a good push for taking no damage, I think, in either the cathedral or the chest, or maybe even both. Of course, the big problem being the fact that I only have one orbital. But hey, it's been it's been done. I can beat one of those bosses with only one orbital before. Or I think I have. Of course, beating them without taking damage is what I was referring to. Beating them many times before with taking damage and... Oh, that's good. And one orbital. Okay. Thought for a second there I was going to be able to do that room. Never have I been so wrong. Do some of that. You know what? I don't even need bombs. I'm too good for... Actually, I'm not too good for bombs. You're never too good for bombs. Especially when they're zombies. Cathedral, here we go. Looking to make that push for no damage. That's a good start. Okay. And here is... Money! That's another good start. Maybe you... We're not even at the start. We're kind of near in the middle, actually. Oh, well, that was impossible to avoid. Maybe we shouldn't count that, but in reality, it does still count, so... Couldn't do it on the cathedral. That's okay. I still got the chest to go. One of two options has failed, but still got one option to go. Gotta look on the bright side. Okay, Mr. Isaac, this is going to be good practice for Blue Baby. Always want a bright side. Okay, well, apparently practice kind of goes out the window when you get hit once. And even more so when you get hit twice. You're done. And you're done. Okay, let's go for the perfect much further away. That's chemical peel. I can take some of that. Don't want your odd mushroom. It is a very nice damage upgrade, but it also is a health upgrade. And I don't want to risk losing my or the effectiveness of the Polaroid. Okay, that was my last key. But hey, I got money. So let's do this, Mr. Judgment. What do you got for me? 9 volts. Nice. That's a good pickup. Just makes me lose my flies. Okay, you're gone. I want another tarot card, actually. Don't need your health. Oh. That could seal the deal on no damage. Good way to start out the room with flies clearing a little bit of space for me. It's not over yet though. Go blue flies. Oh, this could be... This very well could be the room. That gives me enough grief. Okay. Yeah, this room is never really my friend. Let's just say that. I don't care if they're regular carrion queens or champions. None of them are nice. But not this time. 
Oh, please don't be the spider room. It's gonna be the spider room. It's gonna be the spider room. This room always scares me. It's gonna be Loki's. It's gonna be Loki's. There's no way it's not Loki's. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh. Get organized. Get organized. Come on. Focus. Focus here. You're still very much in control of this, this room here. Especially with one down. Especially with one down. Two are down. I got this. I got this. There's no way I don't got this. Uh, Lust, you can go away. Wrath. I'm sorry, buddy. You're next. Hopefully. Okay, don't be the worm that hits me. Wow. I actually went for the right guy. Oh, it was my own blue flies. That was my undoing. Well, let's see if it actually was, or if I can... Or if I would have gotten hit on Blue Baby 2. I probably would have been hit there if I didn't get Halo Flies. But, I didn't. So, the fight, or the challenge was still... been good. At least for now. Oh, don't tell me. Come on. Come on, don't tell me. It's gonna... It's gonna come down for the Blue Flies, isn't it? It's going to come down to the blue flies. My goodness, it came down to the blue flies. That's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Well, let's see if I can clear out the entire chest while only getting hit by my blue flies. Stupid little things. Moving the bomb in my direction. Or maybe something else will cause me to take damage. Not that room, and I got poison touch just just in case I do get hit. Okay, might as well use this. I got, I can use it quite frequently, and it's yeah, it could be a challenging room if I stay here long enough. There's a very real chance I could get hit, and I don't plan on getting hit, so let's double my tears. Let's double down. Oh, actually. I can hold two trinkets. Forgot about that. So I'm still a wrecking machine here. Almost got hit by the spikes. Okay, super slot. You can stay here till the end. In all likelihood. For two. Oh, I was going to say for two reasons. Probably because he has the most health and the fact that. I want him there last, but nope. Apparently that's not enough for him to... for him... to make him stay around. Okay. Mr. Greed is gone. This room... A oh, okay. I've done it before, but that was... You know, with all this rando poop flying around. And this stage of the Carrion Queen doesn't happen when you fight the champion version. Doesn't matter. With Buckable Isle, I can just wreck house. Okay. Oh, greed. That was a well-placed shot. That was an even better placed shot. But none of them connected. Super Sloth is... Almost gone. Wow, they have a lot more health than I think. Maybe next time I see a double super slot, that is if I do, I should use Book of Belial. I'll take your poison bombs though. I'd love to know. Oh, oh! That was close. I would love to know exactly what is in that one gold chest that I have yet to open. Actually, two now, but Super Lust could definitely do it. Super Lust could hit me. That's, well, that was a very real possibility. And use that, because this is the last room, and if I don't use it, well, then it's just going to go to waste. Okay, 
And as a reward, I get the poop. You know what? It's one of those times where the reward is just so bad, I can't even take it. Um, and you know what? I think as an even more special treat for not getting hit by any enemy in the chest, and while doing that, exploring every single room in the chest, I actually am going to explore every room. And I'm going to look for that second secret room, even if it takes me all my bombs. There's only so many options, right? That's another one. Okay, can't be there. Can't be anywhere here. Could not be there. Could be in any of these three directions. Nope. Okay, what about up here? No. Up here. Right there. Not there. Okay, nowhere with this room. Not anywhere in this room. Could be here. Don't think I've actually even been to the secret room. Oh. Well, Super Greed be the only guy that can. Oh, almost did actually. Came very close. Nothing for that room. There's an option here. And an option up here. And an option over here. Okay, running out of options now. Um, could be right here. I think that was... Yeah, that actually was the very last option. Red health, yay! Poison bombs, yay! That one doesn't get a blow up. Okay then. I just beat the chest, and I only got hit with my- oh, well, with one of Wrath's bombs, because the blue flies pushed it into me. I'm pretty proud of that. And I hope you guys enjoyed this run as much as I did. I had a, Whenever I become Guppy, I usually have a blast. Not to mention Quad Shot Polyphemus is also a good time. Coupled with the Book of Blyl means mega damage. If you want to show your support, if you did enjoy this video, you can always leave a like. Or you can also comment and subscribe. If you want to see more Bonnie of Isaac videos, feel free to check out the other ones on my channel. I got a bunch. And as always, until next time, thanks for watching.